Guam's longest running basketball league tips off its 17th season, the Shirley's Invitational Basketball League. Tip off next week with close to 50 teams competing for a chance to be crowned champions. Now, players must be employed by the company who joined the league in order to be eligible to suit up and play ball. We have um, uh, four bracket right now on the uh, recreational section, and then we have one bracket for the varsity. So a total of about uh, almost 50 teams. Uh, we had about 40 last year, and we're getting close to 10 more additional this year. In the varsity division, Team Justice has been dominating the competition, winning the last four championship trophies. Wow, a four-peat. Always Justice won, uh, strong team. Uh, we got the uh, MVP stars, um, and we got the uh, uh, Slingstone, uh, young guys, you know, running gun yeah, yeah, guys. And on the B division, we got a defending champ, SD Corp, uh, along with... Uh, uh, MBI, uh, another wholesale company that uh, strong. Now with so many teams set to hit the court, the gym needed a facelift and the league will be changing out some of the lights and we'll get to see the renovations when teams lace up for the 2016 season. We wanted to give back to the community and this gym needs a lot of uh, work. So uh, we've been working on the uh, putting in a, a, a new set of bleacher. Uh, the old one, the wooden one was starting to crack and uh, it's been here for over 10 years. And we decided to um, also touch up the flooring as the, uh, the old floor is faded and it was kind of dark. So we uh, applied a lighter color uh, to liven up the, uh, the game as well as the, the facility here. Little history for you. The league was formed 17 years ago to help build camaraderie and for businesses to keep their employees healthy and active in the community. Fun and fitness program that the company offered to the staff. Uh, and uh, build up morale, uh, teamwork, um, and uh, just overall sportsmanship uh, from there. Double I, double AG, boys and girls, high school golf teeing off tomorrow afternoon at the Guam International Country Club in Dedido. Teams hit the links at 4 p.m. throughout the season doing their best to shoot under par for the end of the year bragging rights. Harvest takes on Tizen. JFK will face FD Academy in their first match. Guam High and Ukudu square off while GW and Majesty Christian meet up in their season opener. Now St. John's has a first week bye. The 2016 Education 5K Run presented by Couples for Christ and ANCOP takes place September 10th. GPO in Tamuning. Early entrance fee $10 on race day 15. Show 5.30 in the morning. Go at 6 a.m. Register Hornet Sports in Tamuning with proceeds to benefit ANCOP Scholarship Program and Santa Barbara Parish Feeding Program.